I'd rather dip my kanduni in kerosene or gasoline and drop a deuce on the devil's toilet than to upload my course and community to this school platform. It is nothing special about it. It's just overhyped because Alex Hermosi and Sam Ovens collaborated on it. There's no difference between it and you to me. Now, those are some things that the haters are saying. Now, you might say, if you're not a hater, David, then why don't you have your courses and everything on the school platform? Well, the reason being is because I'm currently building my own platform for course creators and community builders and everything. But otherwise, this platform is decent. OK, so now I'm going to go over a couple other platforms that are similar to it and why I, I can understand why a few people are saying there's nothing special about it. Um, the features are you know, ordinary. There's nothing special about the features. Um, it is a lot of hype based off of the people, but that's part of building a brand and everything like that. So that's good and everything. And as you can see, is a million freaking videos of everybody talking about it. So it is a lot of hype about it. But as for the features itself, you can find those features on other platforms, building communities, Udemy and everything like that. Now let's go over a couple of other platforms and I'm going to tell you guys uh, why or why not school would be a good uh, option for you. Okay. So check this out. Um, have school games right here, and this is something that Alex promote uh, Hermosi is over uh, promoting and everything. So this is why everybody is hyped about it. But then I want to show you this, and uh, so if you watch this video yourself, you'll notice that uh, this really goes over the engagement and what they're going to be doing to try to help you guys grow your audiences. And you can also see it on the home page for the school games platform. Yes, this is still the same school situation, but since he has delved into it himself personally, he's going to like help with live workshops, helping you learn how to build communities and, and all of that extra stuff. And it talks about real-time leadership boards and friendly competitions and prizes and stuff. So what they've done that's different from uh, like a Udemy and everything like that, guys, is the fact that they're going to be a little bit more hands-on with making sure you guys become successful with everything so with udemy is still just like a course you come here you pay for you know what you get you can just get any one of these courses they have a lot of courses and everything like that right but then you're just like depending on the like the teacher of each course to engage with you interact with you and help you and stuff we'll know how helpful that's going to be all right another aspect that's a little bit different about it is the fact that it is, is, you know, pretty much full of a lot of influencers that you've heard of that, you know, like we, we even know these jump training people, uh, the high achiever society. I've heard of those guys before. So they have a lot of expert coaches on there and everything reminds me of a more influencer version of uh, masterclass. If you don't know what masterclass is, then let's just go to the homepage. This is the homepage of Masterclass, and it has like celebrities and stuff like courses and stuff like that from celebrities. So they created a version of this. You know, as, as you can see, they're all templated. Like it, it looks just like you to me. It's all templated and everything. All of these platforms is the same. It's about what help you can provide, how much assistance you can provide. Is it just a course they download and then go? Or are they going to be able to do other things? So this one right here, the power behind Masterclass is these are not influencers. These are celebrities and famous people that are good at what they're doing, like millionaires and billionaires and all of that. But you have to be invited to uh, like actually upload a course on there. And as I said before, Anti-Job University is still under construction. It is going to have pretty much the same features and all of that stuff, like being able to build a community. The difference between uh, um, anti-job university in school is well first of all i gotta get the jab jab uppercut i'll tell you guys that on a later video so make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe you don't have to upload over here yet but you're definitely going to want to put your courses on anti-job university as well in addition to any of these other platforms so let's get back to udemy if you guys have never um, been a part of udemy one of the things that make them special is they took the uh the amazon business model or shall i say the walmart business model and Groupon does the same thing. And they make it to where they force the course creators to price their stuff uh, at, a, at an affordable rate. Pretty much <laughs> almost all of the days of the freaking year, you can come over here. And it's always a special. It's always a deal. And it makes it seem like a scarcity, like the deal is going to go away. For example, we will we'll click on... Let's find one of these. Uh, let's click on this one right here. Uh, it, it'll seem as if the special is going to go away. For example, here we go. We got up here, get courses from $12.99 now. And then it always has this right here, ends in 12 hours, right? But after 12 hours, that's going to restart and it's going to have a whole different special up there. So it just has this a uh, uh, tactic of scarcity all the time, which helps it convert extremely high, guys. It converts extremely high. This, but the good thing about Udemy, guys, something that school does not have yet, which I'm sure it will have soon, Udemy's platform is ranking 
organically on Google for so many search terms for courses, and they have an algorithm the same way that YouTube, Facebook, Instagram has an algorithm that will help people find your course. That is the power behind Udemy right now. People can find the course even if you have no experience driving traffic with school since it's new. They don't have this algorithm yet. So you have to. This is why he's doing a push uh, with the games and the contests and, and stuff like that that they're going to be doing, guys, because they are are not yet ranking. They don't have an algorithm that's going to help you find help people find your course or your community. You have to literally go and create content. If you watch this video and you watch his other 10K video, getting to your first ten thousand dollars a month video, he's going to explain to you that you have to create YouTube content, Facebook content, Twitter, Instagram content, all of that content, and send people to the school platform. It's Self. So that's my only boggle with it. <laughs> that's my only issue with it is uh, that, you know, it doesn't have the algorithm yet. Will they get it in the future? This is a smart guy. And Sam Ovens, who actually owns it, is a brilliant guy. So I know eventually they're going to figure out what uh, algorithm rhythms need that like Groupon that Udemy has and everything like that, that will allow the people that are already on the site to be led to your courses based off data and all of that. These dudes run off data. So I know eventually school will get there. So, um, but as for me, I am on working on my platform, Anti-Job University, and I have no problems with Udemy and everything like that. Reason being because of the platform, right? Because of the algorithm that it will send you. I, If I'm going to upload to Udemy, I don't want to have to send people to Udemy. If I'm going to create content about my courses, I might as well like send the people and, and create the content and send them straight here. But I'll upload my courses and stuff to Udemy. Uh, I think Thinkific has an algorithm as well and maybe even Teachable. But if I have to do manual work to send somebody somewhere, I'll send it here instead of here. But you guys that don't have your own platform, this is a good platform. It does have a lot of buzz about it. It is going to get larger pause than it is right now and more popular and everything. So you might want to go and start building a community over there. It, is, it would be better to have it here than just on uh, Facebook separately. So school is a decent platform. If you need a little bit more information about it, you can check this out. If you want to be on a waiting list for Anti-Job University, where you earn first and then learn as you go, the only school for that, then guys, go ahead and get on the waiting list for that. Love you guys. Check out school.